life doesn't seem so easy always does it i had to take the hardest decision of my life my finance improved my relationship improved my health also started to become better what if one decision can transform your entire life your relationship career health even how you see yourself today asha agrawal is here to share her experience of a inspiring story of going from feeling stuck and invisible to reclaiming her power if you have ever felt trapped by life's challenges this journey might change how you see your own have you ever find yourself completely invisible <laughs> no matter what you do no one sees your struggle your potential that's how my life grew up in a small town bandal in west bengal in a joint family i was never recognized for any achievements i was an introvert never ever able to express my thoughts and feelings and i was always carrying that deep pain inside me and never understood where to let it out my parents did their best but they never understood what i was going through in school i was very good student when it came time to grasp ideas but when it came time to articulate on paper i wouldn't so it's clear that i was not a good student by grades until i could find my voice when i did my law degree i found that confidence inside me i found my voice i found that i would express my thoughts my feelings and my actions that new confidence helped me to move forward to build my career and i was always a career oriented person i used to teach in college take tuitions even go for my law practices life seemed that this was my perfect path but you know life doesn't seem so easy always does it i got married thinking that i would build my future filled with love and stability but i was in a complete nightmare in one year and a half year of my marriage it unraveled completely trust issues developed relationship breakdown child care issue my health was deteriorating day by day i had no strength left inside me i was in a complete chaos and i couldn't take it any more i had to take the hardest decision of my life i had to leave my in-laws house and i decided to move to my parents house at that time i was feeling that i was completely defeated but this was the first step in my life when i took the ownership of my own life when i move forward to my parents house i did not allow myself to break down completely i threw myself in deep study i completed my master degree and various other diploma degree and even i got a chance to teach in a college i was balancing my life as a single mother and supporting my family but there was 
always that emptiness inside me, that hollow space inside me, which I was carrying with me, which did not allow to go. I was, it seemed that I joined my family business. It seemed that I was holding everything together, but inside, I was completely scattered. I was completely crumbled. But, you know, always there is the ray of hope inside us. I came across a life coaching program where I thought something will surely change inside me. And that truly happened. I learned there about gratitude, self-love, which I was never aware of it, and taking ownership of my own life. And it really seemed that something inside me changed. I really started feeling good from inside. That emptiness, that hollowness disappeared. And when things started changing inside me, it started reflecting outside. My finance improved. My relationship improved. My health also started to become better. When I saw that the magical thing only just happened when we take the ownership of, my, of our own life, I thought I took this as my mission of life to help those women out who are still living in this victimhood and thinking that change is impossible. So I turned my pain into power and helped those women to find their own financial freedom and their self-respect. Now it's no longer just about me. It's all about those women to see their own worth and break this limiting belief inside them. Now, I also know that I have always thought that we are capable of doing something big. And I know you are sitting here and you deep down, you are also thinking the same, that you are meant to do something big. Life always throws challenges on us. It depends on us how we see these challenges. We see it as an obstacle or as an opportunity. It all depends on us. So if you are sitting here and thinking that life has stacked all odds against you, one trick I can just help you out. It's that take that one step. Take that power back. Take the ownership of your own life and become your own vic from victim to victor and take that first step in your life. Thank you.